All right, guys, gals, and everything in between. You're probably wondering why I'm doing the unconventional filming style. Well, that's because I'm having to do this on my phone because I'm having some technical stuff I'm taking care of on my laptop right now. So I can't really just do a straight-up review, but I had to talk about this bullshit. Okay, so if this is unedited, it's because I don't know how to work all the fancy editing software. So... The X-Files season finale happened, and I've been so excited for that. As you know, I want to believe, I wanted to believe that this show could actually deliver. And I did the first two episode reviews. I stopped after that due to various reasons. Last week, I actually got really sick with the stomach flu, so I really couldn't do the video. But I have to say, I'm just so beyond disappointed with this finale episode. I had to get the opinion out to you. This was horrible. This was one of the worst ways you could end it. It was building to be fantastic. Like, they were like, the end of the world is happening. Like, the world as we know it will die. Like, it, everything fucking sucks. And we're all gonna die and and of disease, and of alien disease, and they kept teasing the idea that maybe in this grand world that aliens didn't really happen throughout all eight to nine, ten, I don't really count the last two seasons, of the X-Files. But, <laughs> now they're like, yeah, 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 so maybe that happened, but maybe it didn't. And you can tell that Chris Carter just didn't know what to write. He probably speculated, like, wouldn't it be crazy if none of the shit that everybody loved never happened? Well, now you sort of get that in one episode. But all of a sudden I was like, we're working towards a finale and we haven't finished anything yet. And this is supposed to be one series. Like, we're not supposed to get another we better get another. As much as I hate to say it sucked so bad we need another, I hate to sound like an overly entitled fanboy, but we deserve another. Because, spoiler alert now, the disease has happened, we're dying, Scully's like, oh my god, we need the disease cure thing from our child whom I've never seen. And then... The agent, not Mulder, goes in and says, well, where is he? And she's like, I don't know. Then a UFO pops up above him and shines a light down. And Mulder's like, hey, because he's dying because reasons. And Scully looks up in the air with agent, not Mulder. And then the light comes down and you're like, what's going to happen? And then Cut to goddamn credits. I'm not even fucking kidding right now. This is a horrible ending to a show. If allegedly, allegedly, you guys claim this is the last season of The X-Files, and you pull that kind of BS on us, that is hands down the worst ending. To the point, I would rather say that the movie X-Files I want to believe is a better ending to the show than this. Hell, I'll take the Lizard Tranny episode, which I love, by the way, over, as like a finale over this one, because at least it had a point. You shot an episode that you didn't finish, and you're telling everybody you don't think you're bringing it back for another one. This is one last romp for the hell of it. You know, one last flyby to an encore to the fans, if you will, and you end it with a cliffhanger like The Sopranos. Guess what? Everybody hates The Sopranos ending. You'll f oh, sure, you'll find like one or two people who are like, actually, that episode was amazingly definitive. No, that is not a good way to end your show. If you are trying to end a definitively amazing show, like you claim that this is the last one, that's why the episode during the open title says, this is the end. 
that wasn't an end. That'd be like me just being like, yeah, well, uh, the, the points of Mulder are done. That's not how it works. Like, what are you guys thinking? Like, at least announce. Announce. Hey, we're doing another season. This is like that thing with Ash vs. Evil Dead that I had the problem with. You end it saying, yep, that's a cool story, complete story, fuck it, we're done. Even though Ash vs. Evil Dead greenlit a season two. So I was a little more lenient on them. This, they didn't do that. And I'm sorry if you guys don't want to hear an angry rant from me. But this is just unacceptable. This is lazy writing. This is telling me Chris Carter didn't have an ending to his show. So what did he do? He gave us a half-assed incomplete ending and said, Fuck it! You guys can just all say it's amazing. Which, guess what? It wasn't. It was great! Until you fucking ruined it with that bullshit ending which was bullshit because of the fact that we have all invested years of our lives loving the show you then spend the beginning of this season saying yeah it might all be a lie well apparently i don't know either because i'm just gonna end it abruptly uh, you know what? I need to tune in next week to Fox and find out if there's even another episode. Because what the hell? I mean, for all we know, there might be. 10 Cloverfield Lane has actually happened. and No one knew that fucking was there. So, oh, like I have never been so mad at a TV show in my life. And I'm a huge X-Files fan. I want to believe, I want to believe there's another season to this. And if you guys get mad at me saying, well, it was actually pretty awesome, think about it. Imagine if every TV show just ended on an abrupt, like, fuck it, no. Just saying, this is unacceptable. This is lazy writing. We deserve better than this. Chris Carter, if you watch this, I'm disappointed in you. I'm so mad at this season finale that I just had to get my opinion out there. This is atrocious. I hate it. And if you say I'm overreacting, then I guess just imagine what would happen, as much as I hate to say this, then let it happen to a franchise you care about and see how you think about it. All right, guys, gals, and everything in between, that was my very anger-fueled, review slash discussion. I didn't really talk anything about the episode because I didn't really have anything to say because this isn't an episode. This was an unfinished thing that Chris Carter spat out and gave to us. So until next time, love you guys.